In this video, you'll see how to enable automated tags for AWS Service Catalog products provisioned from ServiceNow. With this capability, you can add tags to AWS products provisioned by ServiceNow users, retain tag options configured in Service Catalog, and make specific tags available to end users. This is the ServiceNow Fulfillment Portal, where we're logged in as an administrator. To get started, let's open the AWS Service Management Connector and create some automated tags for AWS Service Catalog products. We'll create three kinds of tags. The first tag will be a generic tag that lets us know that an AWS resource was provisioned from ServiceNow. Because this is a generic tag, we won't make it selectable by end users. When the global option is selected, the tag applies to all portfolios in AWS Service Catalog. We can deselect this checkbox and apply the tag to a specific portfolio if we want. For our purposes, we'll make this tag global. Let's submit the tag. Next, we'll create a request tag to show who requested the resource. We'll also create a request tag to show the request number used to provision the asset. Now let's create a tag that will be selectable by the end user. Administrators can select existing ServiceNow table metadata to be populated as an AWS tag. In this example, we will select the cost center table where the tag will allow the user to specify an appropriate cost center for the provisioned product. Now let's go to the ServiceNow service portal and see how the tags appear to an end user provisioning an AWS product. Now that we're logged into the service portal as a user, let's take a look at what products we can provision. Let's provision Apache Web Server. Because this product was pre-configured in Service Catalog, most of the configuration is already complete. We'll specify a VPC and move on to the tags. Under Tags, notice the Chargeback and Service Environment keys. These are tag options that were configured by an admin in AWS Service Catalog, not in ServiceNow. Let's go to the Service Catalog Administrator console for a quick look. Here we can see all the Chargeback and Service Environment key value pairs associated with this portfolio. End users get a multiple choice value list for each key but cannot enter their own value. Returning to ServiceNow as an end user, let's specify a value for each of these tags and then place the order. Here's the request we just submitted. Now that the product is provisioned, let's find it in AWS Service Catalog and take a look at its tags from the admin's perspective. Here we can see all the tags associated with this product, including the tags we added in ServiceNow and tag options coming from Service Catalog. You've just seen how to enable automated tags for AWS Service Catalog products provisioned from ServiceNow. You can learn more about this topic in the description and links for this video. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.